Welcome back guys, got something extra special as always. Today we got the solid yellow gold Rolex Daytona on Oyster Flex. And my favorite feature about this piece is it's got the factory diamond dial. Just a beautiful piece. To be honest, I haven't seen too many with the diamond dials. We've been getting a bunch lately and they're selling super, super quick. This one is actually already sold. So just wanted to show you guys a quick look before it's out the door. And uh, who knows when the next time we'll get another one, but uh, beautiful watch. This is in a 40 mil. We've got the beautiful Oyster Flex clasp, which I love that kind of sits a little bit above your wrist so you don't get that sweaty feel. Great design that they did there. Of course, you have your easy link clasp. So if it does feel a little bit snug, you can you know, either pop it down, pop it in, literally two seconds. So great feature, great watch. I mean, the look is great. Everybody knows Daytona is the pinnacle watch. So especially to have it done out like in a feature like this is just that little bit extra mile that I think just makes this watch and this brand so great altogether. Wonderful customer, great home that this is going to. So definitely good energy going from place to place. So I'm very happy. And uh, if you're watching this, congratulations. We haven't polished it yet. It'll actually be polished tomorrow morning, all set for you to be picked up. So I'm super excited to get this fitted to you, boss. So um, if you guys are looking at the market today, you know, you'll see these pretty, pretty high up there in the price and uh, pretty much how it compares to like this and the solid gold bracelet price difference. You're looking probably somewhere. I mean, I'll be honest with you, the market's crazy right now. So whatever price I do tell you, by the time you see this video, I'm probably completely wrong. Um, but right now I see the market difference in these about 15 to 20,000. It's just a personal preference type of thing. What you could always do is um, you could get that solid gold Daytona and put it on uh, rubber B. We are sponsored for rubber B if you're ever interested. And then you can get that same type of look, but it won't actually be a true Oyster Flex. Rolex will only install and sell you Oyster Flex if it is the correct model. And uh, the reason that is, is not a lot of people know, it actually has to do with your uh, lug casing. So this little uh, gold piece actually is removed on the full gold bracelet, whereas on the Oyster Flex, it stays to give it that extra little bit of touch. Anyways, uh, overall wrist presence when it comes to this piece, I'm gonna give it a nine out of 10. I'm not a huge yellow gold guy. You guys know that from the past videos, but I love this watch. The ceramic on the yellow with the black really makes it pop. Um, it's beautiful. You're gonna see it featured on our channel, hopefully again soon if we get this or any variation like it, but um, definitely a pinnacle piece and everybody who's collecting, you should always have a Daytona in the collection. So keep that in mind while you're shopping. Overall rating, I'm gonna give this watch a nine out of 10. Like I said, preferably, um, for me, I, I do like the full metal bracelets, but I love how they turned it very sporty, very classy looking with this. And uh, my good friend Sebastian's giving me that look, so I'm gonna give this a 10 out of 10 <laughs> instead. So like I said, guys, um, this one today is sold. Just wanted to feature it on our channel so you guys could get a good look at the stuff that we do get in stock. If you are interested and we don't have it in today, you can always give us a call. We'll get it sourced for you. Um, it might not happen super quick, but you never know what's in stock with us. So keep posted. And uh, as always, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe below, leave any comments. And I uh, just want to thank you again for tuning in and leaving all the positive feedback, guys. We're getting ton of calls, ton of sales off this stuff. So we really appreciate you. Thanks for helping our channel grow. Until next time.